Alrighty, friends, Mark of Techpreneurs here, and I'm with Mr. Ivan Pua. He's the product marketing head of Samsung Philippines for smartphones, and he's going to show us the Samsung Galaxy S6 and Edge. Go ahead, Ivan. Um, honestly, this is the best smartphone Samsung has launched ever, uh -huh. or will launch rather. So this is the S6 Edge. This is the S6. Mm -hmm. Actually, uh, if you look at it, it's very similar in terms of specs. The main difference here is this is LTE dual SIM. This one's single SIM LTE. Mm -hmm. uh, in terms of, of course, the design, this is already edge screen. While as this one is the regular look for us of a smartphone. Okay. But so we're getting the Philippines is getting the dual SIM version. Yes, for the S6. Wow. Yes. Wow. So it will be dual SIM LTE already. Dual SIM LTE. Dual so SIM both LTE. SIM both SIM slots will support LTE. No, the primary is LTE. The secondary is actually 2G. Okay, yes. that's good. That's good. Mm -hmm. But still, alam mo naman ang pinoy mahilig sa mga dual SIM. Yeah, exactly. So the secondary SIM, yeah. very very functional for most people. Okay, so I understand, uh, Ivan, that both phones share the same technical specifications, yeah. except for the display and the battery size. Na medyo konti very, lang very minor difference. difference. Yeah. So can you tell me more, siguro, siguro. Let's start with the S6. S6. And all. Can you can you give me the key specs, the key features of the S6? that consumers would want to know, learn more about. Actually, when we talk about the S6 or the S6 Edge uh, in general, we always say this the next is now. Meaning, if you look at it, it's a next level design. So in terms of design, uh, both is it's a mix of glass and uh, metal. So back and front, would, you'll have Gorilla Glass 4. Yeah. The sides would be uh, full metal already. So 100% aluminum. So handsome, yeah. No? Yes, very yeah. premium. So this is actually, if you look at the color also, this is actually the unique color for the S6. Yeah. This is the blue topaz. Okay. So it's very premium, very elegant. Then uh, if you, the next feature I would want to uh, mention is really the camera. Yeah. If you look at it, it's actually the next level camera as well. Mm -hmm. um, it has a quick launch button, just 0.7 seconds versus the a regular smartphone. Yeah. So it's very fast, it's very handy for most people who want to take a, a uh, photo. Uh, also the HDR, mm -hmm. it's actually uh, automatic already here, so it, it's present in the front. So you don't back. have, you don't have to click on a separate button. button yes, exactly. it's automatic. Um, front back because for the longest time it was it was actually um, just at the back mm -hmm. back camera but now you can also use it in front. That's great. Yes, so in terms of camera, 16, me 16 megapixel in the at the back, uh -huh. 55 in front with uh, 1.9 f1.9. So in terms of aperture, yeah. it's actually very uh, bright already. So it can take in more light. Take in more light in a darker space. You'll see more. Uh, it's brighter. It's a better, it'll take a better photo. The sensor, Ivan, is ISO cell, same ISO cell, same as I, the S5. OIS, yes. Okay. Yes. Much, actually, it's much better. Yeah. It's, it, it comes with the OIS, so it started with the Note 4. Mm -hmm. So now with, with the S6, it's actually present in front and back. Because before, it was only present at the back of Note 4. So, of course, OIS is for stable shots, stable shots even yes. if you're moving. That's great. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's great. And then as for the innards, I, let's talk oh. about the display first. All right. It's so pixel dense, nito, diba? I'm yes. looking at it now, so brang yeah. So this is actually the highest PPI smartphone in the market right now. Mm -hmm. It's five seven five hundred seventy seven pixel per inch. So even <laughs> even better than the Note Four. Yeah. yeah. So it's very sharp, very vibrant. I think um, you you would see it right now. It's, it's it comes through life yeah. the pictures. I always say. That in terms of display, also in terms of the innards, naman, Samsung talaga is the best. Yeah, right? the super best. AMOLED is really super something. AMOLED, nothing yeah. can beat super AMOLED. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then speaking of the innards, can we talk more about the processor? Because pareho lang naman to halos yung Yes, actually, both uh, would have a 64 bit processor with a 14 uh, nanometer chip. Mm -hmm. Meaning, because for the longest time we use a 20 nanometer chip, with a 14, it's more efficient, smaller, mm -hmm. allows us to have a more compact and sleek smartphone. Okay. And it's more energy efficient. Okay. It's 30% roughly 30% more energy efficient than the 20 nanometer chip. Actually, that's one of the questions. Can you talk more about the battery life? Uh, the okay. S5 used to be 2. Eight. This one's actually 2,600. Okay, but the, yeah, exactly. I'm sure most people would ask that. Yeah. And the main reason is it's because it's more efficient right now with that 14 nanometer chip. So with that, like I mentioned, it's 30% more efficient. It allows the, the phone to actually have more power or longer battery versus the S5, even at the lower MEH. Okay, so Ivan, I'm looking at the phone now. Sobrang premium, premium na ng design niya. It has yes. the the metal, real metal frame plus the Gorilla Glass front and back. What motivated, siguro, what was the reason behind Samsung's move to make not just their flagship uh, line, but also your mid-range? You have the A series. What what was uh, what's what Samsung vision behind that? Why why the start? why the move? 
to a more premium look for your smartphones? Actually, it's always been the thrust of Samsung. We always look at the consumer. The consumer is at the heart of everything. So if you look at it, this smartphone is made by consumers. What they, what they told us they want, what they're looking for, a metal phone with glass. And we were able to come up with that, with this design because of consumers. Okay, so the, basically it's inspired by, inspired by, by suggestions yes. of consumers, by your market research. Na. Yes. Okay, this one. I'm looking at the S6, sobrang ganda, the sobrang gopping. But this one is more good looking, I think. Can you, yes. can you tell me more about the S6 Edge? So, S6 Edge, if you look at it, in terms of specs, very similar to the S6. Uh -huh. The main difference, like I mentioned, is it's really the, the design, yeah. the screen. So, um, if you look at it, the main difference, uh, you'll see here the people edge, so you can put yeah. five icons here. How many features do you have for the, for the curved display? For the curved display, this is the primary feature. And that's the primary So yes, the edge screen, uh -huh. uh, people edge, so you can, when the phone is on, you can actually, um, <coughs> you have a quick launch for, fi for five people, mm -hmm. five okay. closest people. You can easily call, text them. When they call you, you'll see that a specific color is assigned to them. So that is actually the main feature when it's yes. turned on. When it's turned off, you can actually see the time. There. Oh, there you go. Yeah. So the time, then you can also browse through. You can also browse through the notifications if you have some, if you have news. Yeah, if someone called you, if someone called you, you'll also see. So that's a, that's the main feature of the edge screen. Okay. From the side. okay, so basically those are the main features. Of yes. the features. And then as for, as for the specs, just about the same. Very, no? Yeah, very okay. similar. This one is single SIM. Single SIM. Okay. Do you want to dual SIM eventually? Or for the Philippines, it's really single SIM. Philippines, really single SIM. Okay, so if you want dual SIM, go for the S6. Yes. S6 for dual SIM, this is the premium S6 Edge for the okay, that's great. single SIM. Yes. That's great. And then, um, I want to know, because consumers, of course, would, would right now, siguro of all, sabi ko nga sa blog, of all the Galaxy flagship releases, this is the one that will have lots of competitors na in the market, di ba? And of course, it, it, was, it still has the fanfare then. But, sabi ko nga, this, this one, ito yung papasok sa market na and dami na yung maybe legit competitors, di ba, Ivan? So, can you, can you, siguro, if you were, if you were to talk to consumers, what would be some of the key features, na reasons, why would they would want to get the S6 compared to other phones out there? Actually, um, it's hard to, to uh, summarize everything, but, yeah. Basic in terms of hardware, this is actually the best hardware. I mean, I, I'll just say it's the yeah. best hardware in the market yeah. right now. They always say that, even if I, I also write about other brands, yes. but they always say in, ter in terms of specs, specs everyone no knows. one can beat this. Yes, it's, it's Samsung. So, yeah. It's the only phone with a 40 nanometer chip, yeah. so I don't think anyone can beat that. That, uh -huh. that alone, in terms of processor, much faster, more efficient. In terms of uh, charging as well, yeah. it has fast charging already. You have the wireless charging, it also has wireless yeah. charging built in. In terms of design, but, uh, there's nothing much to say there. I mean, you can see it all together. Very gorgeous. Very so if you want a premium metal, phone, best screen. Gorilla Glass 4, yeah. everything's there. Already, <laughs> yes. Practically the best. I, I called it that. Not in it. But for those who are who will be choosing diba, between the S6 and H, what would you suggest to them? What kind of user would be more attracted to which phone? I think if you're more the you're more used to the, the old smartphone feel, yeah, yeah. you'd go for the S6. Yeah. So uh, if you're coming from S5, or yes, S4, and you're yeah. and you're very happy, and you want that dual SIM functionality in a, in a premium smartphone, uh -huh. you'd really go for the S6 because uh -huh. it's really a beautiful phone for you to have uh, two SIMs also in it. But if you're really, you already want to push the design, the limits of your music. If you want to be the most astig of your friends, yes, you want to be, you want to really stand out. <laughs> you'd really yeah. get the edge. I think you show this to anyone, even you, you saw this. Yeah. Everyone is really uh, hands down for the S6 Edge. Yeah. It's wonderful. Yeah. Okay, so when when are they arriving in the Philippines and how much will they be? It's available uh, mid-April and the prices will be available when we launch it as well. Of course, they'll be out with Smart then. Smart is my yes. partner. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> with the network carriers. With the network carriers, yeah, yes, it's available. Okay, that's wonderful. TV Friends, that's Mr. Ivan Pua. Yes. He's the product marketing head for smartphones of Samsung Philippines. Thank you so much, Thank Ivan. You. A wonderful presentation. I'm very excited. I will get the S6. Thank <laughs> you. Thumbs up. <laughs>